do 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 Anyway, where's... Why do these not have any position? What the hell? Ba, 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 what is going on here? Do, do, do. Oh, it was probably when I renewed this. I forgot to put them back in there. Get in there. Uh, which one is it? Load, which is this one, I think. Ba, 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 do, 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 do. Let's look at the weird points. Yeah, it's the outside one. Train approaching. There you go. God damn it, my beast has been destroyed. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna modify it to be, uh, what should we call it? No breakdowns. I'm not gonna be replacing all of these with inferior trains, no way. Especially the goods one that go 85. God damn it. Hopefully there's a... There's an alternative coming soon. All of these are freaking 70. Ba -da -da -dum, ba -da 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 -dum. How the hell is there nothing better than this one from 1953 with... 80 miles. Luckily, it is pretty short, so I can use three of it pretty easily. Dang damn it! Mm, or maybe I should uh, try and salvage this by modifying its obsolescence date. Maybe it would work uh, in a way, a way where, in a way that the uh, Zephyr train didn't work, which is that it would appear back. Or actually, I can modify it to be reinvented. Like 1982 or something. Damn it, I really need that thing, so yeah, I should probably do that and also check the uh, scenario because I don't remember if there are any uh, better locomotives coming. If this is the only one that can go 85, then I'm definitely gonna modify it. So yeah, I need to take a break and think things through. Alright, crisis has been averted. I modified this beast to be reinvented in a few years and then it'll never become obsolete because uh, turns out there's no better uh, cargo locomotive than this, so I wanna keep it. I am reliant on it, especially my uh, coal and oil trains, they would struggle with those hills without it. Mm, I I really dropped the ball when it comes to selecting vehicles for this scenario. I should have just like picked a set because there are some like sets that I've installed instead of randomly picking here and there and and such because that was a bad idea and it led to having a lot of similar locomotives like these and a lot of similar uh, carriages like uh, three different colored for colors for those when I could have chosen more uh, cargo locomotives or passenger locomotives or whatever. But that's unfortunate because I can't change anything about the scenario without starting a new game. I can only uh, modify the, the existing vehicles, which I did to this one and the uh, Zephyr one on these trains. Anyway, now I've added the new uh, high cube box cars on the trains that uh, bring goods from Kansas Refinery to over here. Where there's something uh, that I forgot to mention, some changes, I uh, moved that platform down there where the goods trains go uh, so that the uh, bypass here can go like that with an S bend and, and then it also goes that way <coughs> along with the normal track here which combines here instead of that massive bridge that I had earlier and uh, path through here and a weird uh, turn there so those are gone much more streamlined now <coughs> and uh, now the bypass also works correctly whereas uh, previously when it started here they went sometimes into the bypass and sometimes into Houston now they only go into the bypass if there's a train loading at Houston speaking of Houston uh, I was thinking I could do a, a little uh, little ship route here, the new, uh, what you call it, what was it called, the hydrofoil, 
That looks like a good place there because it'll attach to a huge to an exchange. Could even go to Jackson over here if I made my own river, but uh, nah, that's where the trains go anyway, so let's just go somewhere nearby, like over here, over there, or both. I can't go over there though because of this tunnel here. Yes, they have spread a bit over here when I built these roads. Come on, do it faster so I can get more passengers into the airport. But where to put this thing? I could make some land here for it, right in the middle. Stuck in the middle with you. The <coughs> horns are blaring. Speaking of blaring horns, I... Uh, Managed to remove some of those uh, the railroad crossings here thanks to a tip from one of you guys. It turns out the, the competitors remove uh, their road almost immediately after you destroy the, the crossing railroad part of it. So I did that to get rid of them. Mm, how about a third one over here? Right there, right there. Actually, I shouldn't use that. I should use one of these cool-looking custom ones. Uh, mm, central, maybe. Yeah, dude, this one should be a central one. It'll pop out more from uh, between the buildings. Then maybe that one here. Do -do 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 oh well, there's there's. Good spot right there. And then the third type. There's one over here. Da -da -da -da. Let's change uh, the range of these. Which way is north? It's upwards. So this could be Houston East Ducks. And this one will be Houston. Come on. Damn it. It's not giving me the arena. There you go. Here's the West Jacks. And these will be Houston Jacks. <coughs> then a little hydrofoil or two. But up, but up. There it is. From West to. Mm, let's put a waypoint to east, another waypoint to Houston, back to west. Bam, bam, yes, more oil, that's what we need, especially now that I added the bigger boxcars to those goody trains. <coughs> let's uh, expand these stations and also add decorations to them via this thing. Let's put one there and there. And then use the signals. That one then. This one there. And there, and oh, no, it's glitching through with the other one glitch. Yes, oh well. What about this one? We need, uh, what was it? Uh, station type. Yes, that one. Speaking of iron, I should build a route from that because my other iron mines are doing poorly. They have. Terrible production right now. Do, 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 maybe one more, one more right there. Do, 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 do. <clears throat> I don't have any extensions for that thing. But let's extend them with bus stations. Uh, I can't get past this because there's an intersection right there. No, no, it'll still create a new station. Put it there, put it there, put it there. 
can't get over that because there's three three rails. Let's go this way then. It's probably enough. In the west side, east side, west side. Good enough. What about this one? It's probably already uh, hyperextended. How many passengers? Only six. Get a full load at least. Yep. This one has plenty. This one too. So maybe another hydrofoil that goes in the other direction. East to west to docks to dead and back east. <coughs> now let's get back to that uh, car route. First car delivery from here. Uh, oh yeah, I was gonna determine the length of the rail, or uh, not rail, the train over here. Da -da -da. Uh, so I'm gonna have to use something else at least for a few years until the mighty Union Pacific 50C beast will come back. Mm, I guess I'll use these if we go to 75, but should I? Try three of those to utilize the speed fully, or just go with like two of these, uh, or one of those. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Let's try one of these because it's probably mostly downhill from here. And then I can mix and match with some of these. Uh, although that brown one kind of looks poopy, you like these two better. It looks like it's even like uh, a bit smaller when it comes to height. Well, let's use all three anyway. Regina Airport no longer accepts. Let's make sure this place does. Yes, sir. Bad side is it can change any time if that auto dealership decides to close. Where they at? Where they at? There you are. There's still room for one, perhaps. Yep, 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 the blue one. Where the hell? There it is. Yeah. Fits, fits nicely. So we're gonna get out of there and go all the way over here to uh, Dallas Auto Plant load. Right then, then we shall add the extra platforms. One, two, three, four. Oh no, but I think once I add these, it'll accept it. Yes. Kind of funny how it works like that. Do -do -do -do. Oh no, actually, it's mostly. God damn it, it's mostly uphill. I was. <laughs> my brain was fooled when I was building this train over there in Albuquerque. So this thing does need a lot of power to get up those damn hills. Uh, mm, if I get rid of that, can I fit a locomotive? <coughs> we are. Oh man, it's pretty damn close. Did, oh, there's some space here, so I think it does fit. Mm, let's add that in this end. Ooh, tanker truck, yes, I can renew my uh, tankers now, or at some point. Let's give them those orders and then put them in the loading position. Yeah, there's still plenty of room. That's good, that's good. More waypoints. <coughs> this is too big. That's not what she said. Yes, I think it's this one, but it doesn't matter if I put it here where it's uh, with the most of the trains that come through here. Bum, bum, bum. Doo -doo -doo. Right after that. Bup, 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 
Ba, ba. Let's put one in there. Make sure it's the right track. And then it needs to do the old switcheroo. Throw that track. Do, 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 do. Boop, 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 boop. And then. Mm, I guess that's good enough. Then we'll go there. Round the band. Do, 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 do. Onto this track. Let's put one there. One. Let's put one right before that, and then. Oh god, there's a lot of. A lot of what you call it's intersections here. Hopefully, it won't get lost. <laughs> One there, and then it goes to the uh, that track, and this track, and back to the loading position. Gonna take a while for it to get a full load though. Uh, speaking of, I, I was gonna add another auto parts uh, train from here. Oh fuck, damn it, speaking of auto parts, why did I add auto parts things to this? Uh, no, of course it carries automobiles and not the auto parts. Do -do 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 -do. Get those out of here. I gotta switch that wrong. wrong cargo type. Uh, so now I gotta decide which auto thing, automobile thing. This one goes 75, that one's 85, but carries less. Although it's John Deere, so that would look cool. <laughs> uh, those auto parts. I think there was one more automobile one somewhere. It's probably a really old one. Or maybe it doesn't exist. Talking out of my ass. Oh, it's that one. Yeah, 35, but only 18 cars. Let's do that one then. Oh man, that's quite long and big, those things. Does it fit? Oh crap. Not entirely sure about that. Let's build another train, the one that's gonna carry the auto parts. With the. Uh, yeah, that one's got the most power. Oh no, I added it to this one. Full load of automobiles. <laughs> then I can use this as a test subject. Yes, fits. And yes, very good, very good. So let's go, let's go over here. All the way to Chicago. Actually, it's more like <laughs> Milwaukee Airport. What the? Why is there Milwaukee Airport in Chicago? <laughs> no. This one is gonna go down here. <coughs> Ten cars, yeah. 